Mm-hmm. But I feel like, all right, so what we talking about, we talk, we, uh, yeah. one of the examples was De'Ara and Ken. Right. So I guess Ken cheated on De'Ara. Mm-hmm. Allegedly. They allegedly. saw Harry. That him. nigga cheated. Yeah, he cheated. Oh, whoa, whoa. Y'all can't just put that man. You, I, say you, allegedly. Know, you don't know shit. You, you, he cheated on her with you? Nah. All right, then fuck is you talking about? So you can't say he didn't He cheated. cheated. You don't know that. They, they, it's, it's was he multiple. in your box? He said, wow. So don't say he cheated. Want, what? To envision? Let, where are you going with that? Just relax. Like, that didn't even be, say anything. Want, it should be no. That's it. Do no. you want? Like, what are you talking about? I'm saying, do you, want to even envision, <laughs> do you want to even envision that? Because you said it so, like, freely. No, I'm saying, if he wasn't in your box, don't say what he was doing in another, the nigga nigga, cheated. In another bitch box. He cheated. I think he cheated. Wow. He cheated. I don't anyway. think that was his first time cheating. I've read it on a yeah. couple of. All right. So all I'm saying is. He's a cheater. Yeah. A bitch you. A bitch you. Yeah. Yeah. So all I'm saying is. I don't know what the fuck. <laughs> what are you trying y'all. to say, Jill? Um, I'm not coming. I'm a nigga. Name. I said, Jay. What are you talking about? What? What nigga name I was about to you call you? Jahil. Hey, you're cr- <laughs> Jalil. You're Jalil. crazier than Jalil me. Jalil Beats. <laughs> <laughs> you fuck Jalil Beats? It's like, no. But no, no, no. Wow. For the record, I've never <laughs> fucked Jalil. <laughs> One. Go ahead. But I, I think that's what comes with <laughs> it. And place. I feel like we was having this conversation yesterday. I feel like when you're a, a couple in public, you uh-huh. gotta deal with those things of people having something to say, people um accusing you of doing things that you right. might not have done, people even seeing you and just having their own opinion of yeah. it. I feel like with that we gotta be careful because we were talking about it yesterday, like even us, right? Yeah. Even given our problems to the public, we gotta be careful because some people look at us in ways for motivation. Some mm-hmm. people look at us in ways of like inspiration and, and mm-hmm. things like we're on a sta- uh, uh, pedestal. 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 Mm-hmm. Thank you. And what happens is once you give them too much, they look at you like you're normal, mm-hmm. and it's like, what do you want? Mm. You know what I'm saying? Do you want to be normal or do you want to be idolized? Idolized. You yeah. know what I'm right. saying? So it's like, at that point, what do you want? So we was having a conversation I, yesterday mm-hmm. and I feel like it was good, but I feel like I ain't getting the energy, the same energy from yesterday. So I'm trying to figure out <laughs> what happened. We, so the energy was good. We I didn't a get a chance to talk yet, but I got right, energy. That's what I'm saying. Don't you know, I'm all, I always got the energy. So, okay, this is how I feel about it. I think that this is a young couple. You feel me? I think that they make their money off of their public relationship on YouTube. Mm-hmm. And I think that when you're young, you fall in love and you think it's forever. Mm-hmm. And I think that majority of the times that does not, that's not how that plays out. Now, this is a new generation and our generation, you know, we was, we was on that love shit too mm-hmm. when we was younger mm-hmm. and then mm-hmm. it didn't work out. But it's mm-hmm. like, because that's how they make their money. It's almost like, can they cut it off? Even if he really is unhappy and that, well, obviously he's, if you're cheating, I believe that obviously you're unhappy. I don't care what anybody says. You're unhappy. So that's not true. I, wait, I, no, on, I think that wait, you're wait, unhappy. No, no, no. I'm they not said, saying, said, no, they that's 26. true. Nah, she's true. Nah, she, she got a point. She, she got a point. a new generation but, though. But, we well, that young. But no, they're like 18, right? Not they're no, 26. No, 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 you say that, oh, they're 26? That's why I said it. Okay, but 26 even, I feel like this is a little bit, younger than us and i think that even they had more access to social media and shit like that in high school and stuff like that you gotta remember when i was in high school there was no iphone yet you know what i'm saying it was a sidekick and shit like that That's so nice. they were able to record themselves and 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 get online and do all this extra shit and i think that that's how they make their money so if you're unhappy but this is the bulk of your money can you really walk away no so what do you do you start to cheat but but it wait. got caught now if he never got caught this wouldn't even be a conversation. He wasn't trying to get caught. You feel me? So because they're public, it's a catch-22 because that is how he got caught Shout because somebody recognized him. You know no point saying? intended. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so somebody recognized him. You feel me? But that doesn't take away from the fact that, you know, that he really was doing something in his normal, regular life. You know, it, well, he wasn't filming at that, mo- at that moment. So that's something he was doing in his real life. For all we know, his bitch... It's done with him too. And they got to keep this up to get this money. But what I was going to say is I don't agree with that because one, I, I agree what you're saying, but kind of not because you don't have to be unhappy in your entirety, in your entire relationship. I didn't say entirety. Right. I said no. you got to be unhappy not though. Right. You're so unhappy moment, about something. It could have been something that she was unhappy or it could be immaturity because you could be, it's not that you're unhappy. It's just, you don't know how to deal with your feelings that something, somebody that hurts your feelings and you just don't, you're not mature enough to deal with it on your own. Right. So it's not even unhappiness. And then when it goes into like them being Together, um, not together. I feel like this is the conversation that I wanted to have. A lot of times, even outside of a public relationship, when you introduce something, um, important or I don't want to say important, when you introduce something more than yourselves 
into anything, now it's it's harder to walk away. For yeah. example, a child. It don't have to. It don't have to be a public relationship. It could be a child. You can have a, a child, and then a lot of times it's like, all right, you know what? This is bigger than us. It ain't just about us, right? Yeah, you cheated, or yeah, you hurt me. A lot of times we see this, and, and niggas don't want to uh, admit it. Apartments, houses. You got a lease on somebody. You got you got a lease with somebody, and now it's like, damn. It hurts we, you more to yeah. separate exactly. than it does. Of course, to, right? To so try I don't to work it out. That, it's cheaper to keep her, right? But I don't. I mean, yeah. <laughs> but it ain't came I, from nowhere. Project, they, yeah. Right. Yeah. But I don't think that uh, I, I think more times it's what you have to lose than being unhappy. Though, honestly. But see, the, the, here's the thing, though. If you're in something and now you're in it because you don't want to lose that, that's not the relationship anymore. So mm-hmm. it's like it, it, it doesn't. It doesn't make up for it doesn't justify you being unhappy. And it almost, it's just that you aren't leaving because you can't lose that. You'll be unhappier without that. But that has nothing to do with the actual and I, love. And I almost feel like it makes it more comfortable for Ken to do what he did because the fact that, well, this ain't this. really going to end. Yeah, you ain't going nowhere. She's, gonna, she's not going to lose that well, bad. You know, and, I mean, and, and, and not to say... Right, like well, that's what I said. Right. Yeah, I compared it to Chris Sales and Queen Naja right. because it was a very similar situation. And Queen Naja said right. she was almost afraid to leave him because she thought she would fail. But once she got that support, when and she couldn't take no more, she left, and it ended up working for her. But she was staying with him after being reasons. abused yeah. for the wrong reasons. But the main reason was for that income from yeah. that YouTube. But yeah. I feel like I feel like even let's go back. Right, a lot of our, our grandparents, great grandparents, they were married, and they they were married through a lot of bullshit. Yeah, yeah. Like, I feel like. You need some of that. You need some something more than just love. You need something more than just who you are. It's even even yeah. with, even I, I compare everything, but it's even with your goals, right? Sometimes even me, I fall out of love with my goals. Sometimes I'm not happy where I'm at. Sometimes I want to quit, but it's something that drives yeah. me past that. So even in a relationship, right? It's not just about me and you. You gotta find what drives you past that. It right. gotta find what what the reason for it, the mission. But, right. You know what I'm saying? And I feel because like a lot even, of times, because it ain't what we think is love, yeah. it's not the, the real thing. But I feel like, nah, that's just cliche. We gotta Because even when you think back to like Jada and Will, mm. like, you know what I'm saying? You look yeah. at the situations like they, they've they tied but so I think much. They're in the, they're, I think Jada and Will are like the the more uh, matured version, version of it. Of it. Yeah, they're like, staying exactly. together because, because, because it's, it's, all like, it's, now, it's more It's more when so. When they were younger, it probably wasn't I'm sure the same. This, I'm sure it was terrible when they were younger. Matter of fact, I mean, you think know, about it now. I've he heard he had. No, but I'm saying you know. one of them ain't in love no more. I guess. I don't think that. I just, I just, I just think it adds I, to the story. I really think it's Will. But but think about it. I think now Deaver and Ken, it adds to that story when they're older. Now they can say, you know, it was times where I did this when I didn't mean it, or it was times when she made when she did this and she didn't mean it. It just adds to the story. So I'm not saying that. Like, okay, obviously stuff like that happens. I'm just saying one perspective of what it could be. Mm. Now, it could just be the nigga had been with her for so long and he stepped out in this part of life and they're going to grow through this. But it also could be the other thing. We really don't yeah. know. Right. But we all right. can agree that had there not been that YouTube, that this probably would play out a lot differently. We can't agree to that because there's people that have regular relationships that go through the same shit. That's real. Yeah, and, 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 like but said, at a young age, a lot of them break up. But, but like I said, it's been, it's, 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 well, it's, it's a lot of girls who stay through infidelity. Right. I but mean, most, at Deer's no, age, I was staying most, through infidelity. Like, I but did. eventually you left. Oh, yeah, And this sure. isn't his first time. So that's what I'm saying. Yeah. You know, and especially think know. about it. Think about it. You got your, you got money. Mm-hmm. You feel me? You got a little name. Mm-hmm. I mean, you might be like, fuck you, nigga. But the yeah. problem is, you're attached to this goddamn yeah. name. Yeah. So now it's, mm, fuck yeah. you, Now nigga, you're more. Put the camera on. Okay. Right now right. you're more right. inclined to stay. We got to work. Yeah, we got work. shit to do. So it's yeah, not a know, relationship anymore. It's just business. But you know, so, Sade. Yeah. It's mostly business but probably. now, Jay Hill. So have you ever, have we argued and are you second guess breaking up with me because of the podcast? Yeah. Damn, that's yeah. crazy. Fuck this podcast. It's done. We ended but up I'm telling that. Like, because it's not even just you a podcast. With a, I never stuff. thought about, I never not broke up with you because of the podcast. What? I've never, nigga, I've so never. You, so you're going to sit here and lie and say, like, something else. You, we have argued and you be like, I mean, but, we, you know, the podcast, you ain't, you it, never saying, you want to say, we never always had that conversation. But you always have to factor it in. You always, to, that's what I'm saying. It's not that I was like, I can't do this because the podcast, but, but I, I factored you. it in. That's what I asked you. Okay, Mr. Literal. But I think that I'm saying I like think, factoring in it. I think that yes, when, you really, I have. when you really don't but want something, you will leave. You don't give a fuck what it is. That's what I'm saying. I don't give a fuck what it is. There we go. So, like, if I really didn't want it, like, that might have been an excuse. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, but even, even in still, I factor in other things outside of the podcast, outside of our relationship. The your relationship apartment? with the Maya, our that? apartment. Like, it's a lot of things. Wow. What? All I factor in. You're a liar. Oh, look, he lying like I'm shit. Lying like Go shit. ahead. He's a liar. But you know what? When shit. you become adults, 
that's what life is. Like yeah. it's your partner. So obviously, you know, you have assets joined or you have uh business joint yeah. you've, you've invested yourself. right right so now i'm like <laughs> i gotta go because i need to go find my nigga because now i get it <laughs> turn this off <laughs> no but like uh, seriously tell the camera you're yeah, sorry I'm, tell the ca- tell the camera <laughs> didn't understand it now i get it okay so yeah that makes a lot more sense jay yeah. thanks because if welcome, yeah you got you me, look bro. a lot better a now too. Healing, you know what i'm saying we, you look a lot better now. yeah yeah. Exactly. yeah you look great so that's very true when you get older there, uh, there are other factors that you're supposed to consider, yeah. and mm-hmm. it's business and other things like that. And you're not; it's not just supposed to be oh, love, love, love. It has to be like, Fuck what are we? Alex. What are? Where are we getting with this? Where are we going with this? Like, how are we building? Yeah, in the midst of that. Yeah, but well. I still, I still say that when somebody's not happy with something, yeah. they will find their way out. I don't yeah. care how much money's Girl, on the table; none I, of that yeah, is worth your unhappiness. Right there is bullshit, though. Not saying what you're saying is bullshit, but the fact that we do that. That's you, well, yeah, that again, you compromise like I, yourself. Like I said, not even compromise yourself is the fact that you don't. Because in my what career, mean, what? it's been mm. times where I wasn't happy and mm-hmm. I stuck through it. No, but I think she's you saying, saying. So why no, would I do I that th- to somebody? Okay, because at a point, you still love it. See, there's a point where you just don't love it at all. Anymore. Or is it because you're saying, saying, so like, do you, you see the light at the end of the tunnel when you look, compromise it because you can still see the light? My, but if yeah. you don't see the light, but if you would don't you still see the light, you move. Sometimes I don't see the light. That's why I, that's mm-hmm. why I get weary of it well, because it's like, y'all been doing this for how many years? Where the fuck is the light? And it's kind of like, it's kind of like you've seen the, um, the, it's a meme, but it's a video where the guy is digging for the, for the diamonds, right? He's he right get, there. He gets, yeah. He's digging yeah, and then he quits. a thousand diamonds. The one dude gets the, is one diamond. That's it. He, he goes to share it. Right. And the other guy quits to go kill him to get his diamond. Right. I say that like, you don't know where it is, even though you don't see the light, we don't know what. And in, in so, a relationship. Hold up. I, wait, wait, hold on really quickly. Cause I like that analogy about the job and you don't quit. So has, has, I guess the cheating, I'm trying to equate it here. Would it be like you hate your job and then it's like you call out sick even though you're not sick? Yeah. But Is that even, the same thing I as the cheating? cheating? Like you right? step out for a second, cheating. but you, you didn't come to that final decision so yet? I'm, all right. I only can talk about marriage because, I mean, I haven't been married, but I'm thinking because in relationships, it ain't. Everybody's single. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? In marriage, though, right? It's a bigger goal. You made vows What do you mean you're single? Yeah, yeah. I'm and, and, and in a marriage, right? You have vows to this person. So you have a commitment to this person. In my, in my job, in my career, I have a commitment to my career. I, I made. I said I was going to pursue something. And I'm going to get it. I'm going to do it until I get it. When you marry somebody, you eliminate you and you create us. So when it becomes to us, when somebody cheats, you got to get to the bottom of that. And that's why therapy is so important. Oh, yeah. So it's not about, it's not about, because hopefully. But what I, if the bottom of it is, I'm not happy with right. you. Right. No, no, right. And, and, that's what I, and that's where I was right. going to go. I feel like sometimes. It's nothing like, you're going to do that's going to make me happy Even when we were again. talking about seeing the light at the time, I think like at some point you still think like your, your job is still worth it. Mm-hmm. It's still some progression. Like there is sometimes. Where it's just like, you know what? There is no more light. And I don't even want to see so it. No there cap. is more. So I, don't so no I don't care. Nothing, I don't nothing's care. worth no me yeah. staying yeah. through no this. Cap. I'm, I'm done. My right now. I swear mm-hmm. to God, right? That's one of the main reasons why I, like when me and Shadi argue, that's why I wanted to stay with Shadi. Because I told myself, now if I'm like, yo, I can't sit up here and lie and say I didn't see no progression. And because I've seen progression, that's why a lot of things I've told her that I didn't want to tell her, I've told her because I, honestly, it's a part of me, just to be honest, a part of me want to work through that. A part of me honestly kind of want that. You get what I'm saying? A part of me want that story to be like, yeah, we had some we shit talked it out. and we, we got it out. through it, right? Mm-hmm. Like, so that's why a lot of times with things I don't want to tell her, I'll tell her because it's like, yo, I know this about to be some bullshit, but at the end, it's gonna be worth it. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. And even though I might, it might have been some bullshit. I ain't even smoke it. That's but, my yeah. point. But even even though what I might have did presented with some bullshit, or it might have been bad. It's like, yo, you know what? I'd rather take that L or take my accountability right here to get to the to the end. Yeah. I say that to say, a lot of times when we were beefing, it was like, yo, you know what? I've seen the progression, and I think this is so much dope. You get what I'm saying? Like, this is dope, and I feel like a lot of times we be ignorant to the progression. So even if somebody did cheat or like, I don't know, like whatever, we got to understand that, yo, they are fighting, like I was saying in marriage, when you marry somebody, when you decide to commit to somebody, you got to well, understand. they're engaged. Right. It's not even that. You got to understand that, yo, they, I'm, I'm marrying to you. The hardest part of our relationship is growing together because mm-hmm. goddamn, yeah. it's hard to grow, to, yeah. grow individually. So when you're growing together, you have to understand that they ain't perfect. It's like, I'm not perfect. And it's times where I don't even want to look at myself yeah. in the mirror. So if it's, if she fucks up or he fuck up. I got to be so willing to be like, yo, I'm going to fight through it with them, even though I don't want to. 
Because there's been times I had to fucking bite my tongue. There's been times where I had to kiss ass or whatever in my career when I didn't want to and I cried. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So if I can do yeah. that for my career for something that's that can get stripped away from me, why not do that for somebody that I call family? Right. And so that kind of goes back to the Nikki Giovanni thing, essentially, what you're saying. <laughs> yeah. Because it's like, I'm doing it for these other, this other part of my life, but why can't yeah, I why apply can't it you to do this it? situation? Yeah, it's like, yo, right and I also feel like, even for like their situation, you know, I don't really know where they're at directly, but like, you know, I'm also open to the other side of the fact that like, I don't know if that is them. No, that, no. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's, cause that's like for Dear, that might've been like, we did see the progression, but I no longer see it anymore because you keep re like, what is the word? Regret, you regress, regressing, regressing right? You keep regressing and it's not progression anymore. So there are some points, you know what I'm saying? I'm not talking about for our relationship, but other, you know, speaking, it could be the fact that it's not progressing. You know what I'm saying? Especially because there is Insanity. speculation that this is not the first time. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I don't know 100%. I just know what gets said and what I've seen so far. It's, it's not his first time and it could be yeah. potential regression. And it is sucks that they are in the public because they do have to deal with that in the public limelight. Um, and, you know, I feel like there's got to be some truth to it, it because she didn't come out and say anything. She hasn't said anything. So and, you know, and, and that's where I was going to go next. It's just. How do you think he feels as the one? So so say like it's it's on where Jazz saying like they might be done for real. And because the cameras are on, he was just really living, living his, his normal. Life. Because right. one thing I seen in his apology it was like, yeah, I did touch her butt. Like, you know, what I'm saying inappropriately. But he acknowledged it so easy as if like that's He's something allowed to do that. Like it's the norm. And I was going right? to say. It, how do we know? No, like, how do you think he feels like being the one who got caught living his, his truth regular life or his regular situation? And like, say they are just doing it for the cameras, the cameras, and like they're not ready to let that side go. And now he's the one who gets caught because even the apology was so like vague. It like, it's, so it's almost vague. like as if she knew. And I'm sorry that this came out this way, yeah. and now you're embarrassed because that ain't right. Because we know what it is, is yeah. between us. Yeah, like say, you know what I mean. All I'm gonna say is this, yo. I'm not gonna speak to the like. But what if, like, if they wasn't, I'm just saying, what if they are? Because, hold on, wait, another thing that I thought was odd was that he was out. And right, she wasn't She out. wasn't even out. And, and it's out like, girls. Yeah, and so I ain't seen no niggas. Me either. Where was so niggas? it's like, where, and where were you? Like, right. was, why were you so, just out here? What like, I'm, what I'm gonna say yeah. is, I'm gonna say to the point, if they are together, right? I feel like, as a, as a, as a human race, right? And I'm gonna say for both sides, men, we gotta do better at seeking therapy because cheating mm -hmm. comes from something within. Just being honest, right? And I'm gonna be totally transparent. You gotta, we gotta, we gotta seek something that when something don't go our way, to to handle it another way than stepping out our relationship. Hold up, women cheat too now. No, they I, sure I know, do. I know, but I, sure we talking do. about for the most part, we seen all of our idols cheat on that woman. I, I seen a tweet Kanye that said that like, damn, Derek yeah. Ken, Jay Z, Cardi, so, Offset, like so, they literally named. So what I'm saying, no, 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 just get caught. But I'm not, I'm not speaking on idiots. I'm not speaking on women. I mean, you cheat on Beyonce, you got wait, to be a fool. But wait, I'm not speaking. I'm only speaking <laughs> from a man perspective. If they cheat, then they can speak on that on their own. But this is something in my life. I'm gonna say like, as men, we got to do a better job at handling our emotions. And before that, we got to do a better job at seeking help because we don't know how to, yeah. or even when nothing is going wrong. And woman, all I can ask, right? I'm pretty sure it's things that y'all can work on just like we can work on. What I will ask is continue to be patient with us because it's not personal. It's really personal with us. It ain't personal to you guys. It's really personal to us. So what I would say is woman, continue to be patient with the men, right? And Jay. not to the point where it's though is hurting you. Jay, yeah, she's okay. like your course. mom. But I'm just Jay. No, I'm saying like, I feel no like because I was going to say, you know, there's a difference between, and I think this is important for women to understand because this is how a lot of women end up in situations Real where shit. they're dead. Yeah. Um, they yeah. lose their children, something yeah. crazy because yeah. they kept saying, well, well, I'm gonna be patient. I'm gonna be patient with him. Yeah. I'm gonna be patient with him. Yeah, yeah. of course. And know when to walk away too yeah. as well. Learn you gotta know when to walk Learn away as well. That's, I'm, I'm just really, I'm, I'm trying to, I might not be saying it right, but I'm trying to give you guys props and like, you know, I said it before, it's, it, it hasn't been fair for women. You know what I'm no. saying? And again, right. it's been times, there's a lot of things I think women do to niggas that ain't fair too. I this agree. Ain't, I agree. Yeah, but this yeah, ain't, yeah, I'm yeah. not speaking yeah. on that. I can yeah. speak yeah. on that when the time is allowed. You know what I'm saying? For right now, we're talking about Ken cheating on Yeah. yeah. So in this moment, I'm only acknowledging the men that cheat. You know what I'm saying? So what I'm saying is, shout out to the women that are patient, right? Of course, you got to know when to walk away. Mm -hmm. Of course, you got to know when it's time to go. Mm -hmm. I can say that about men and women in situations. Mm -hmm. But again, all I'm saying is, continue to understand that in every situation, is not always the same. Yeah, it's and, not. And, and you I think you had to learn. And you shout you out to, to my learn. woman. Let me say, shout out to the woman because y'all don't get it fair. Yeah. You know, y'all, I ain't gonna lie. Like niggas, every nigga got. Is, yeah. is and, like I, and I think it's just important for women to learn. So shout how out to, to the woman. Shout out to them. Thank you, babe. Oh my shout god, was that rare? Yeah. Wow. See, we can't even just. Say. Clapping. 
So what I will say is too, like, you know, just in terms of what Jazz said, because I think that's a huge point as well. And I understand what Jay's saying. But I also think that like women just have to do a better job picking guys that are even worth fighting for. Because mm-hmm. I think a lot of time women pick men and think they're giving them the same discernment as the man who is worthy of having that Damn. discernment. Mm-hmm. And sometimes that's not just I'm gonna true. I'm going to go with you, baby. Yeah, like. I'm going to go with you with this one. Yeah. I don't think they got to do a, and, and Alex too, I'm a, I don't think they got to do a better job at picking the men, right? You got to do a better job at picking yourself and God. Mm, picking God period. and being yourself. Because yeah. a lot of times yeah. we're not praying in these situations. Yeah. Things happen yeah. and we're not praying. You know what I'm saying? You yeah. gotta, you gotta do a job. I mean, yeah. I don't know what y'all. Or be just intentional I mean, on what you want. Like yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. being intentional on what you want. Because like to you mentioned Cardi yeah. B and Offset, and it's like, but he's still cheating on her to yeah, this day. Like, we don't know that. Uh, it yes. just happened. Yeah. Remember, and she filed for divorce, and then she, and she went right back. It. She said it. Like she said it out her own mouth. So I think it's one of those things where you know, you you have to decide when you are not loving yourself to love somebody else. Exactly. That's when you got to yep. walk both away. Both sides. Yep, both sides. Yeah. Yep. Once you stop loving yourself to love somebody, yeah. then it's time for you to go. Alrighty, man. That was a great conversation. Gemini Scorpio Podcast, episode yeah, 46. T-